I think the real question is what don't I really like about it? From the moment that I met Susan and Bob, it was just a really great connection and they completely wanted to photograph everything that I wanted to photograph while letting me be myself. And the pictures just turn out phenomenal. Better than any photographer that I've ever worked with. So actually, I was on Facebook, because that's what I do. Um, and I actually saw they were trying to hire ambassadors and seeing the photos of the other girls and how fun it looked like they were having and just everything that they stood for, I approached them. The link wasn't working, but we met the same day and they brought me on board and it was one of the best choices I think I've ever made. Aside from the fact that they do the most phenomenal Star Wars photography with me, I love that I've built a relationship with both Bob and Susan, more on a personal level than just, you know, a professional level, and being able to go back and forth with ideas and spitball things, and they're always on board with everything I want to do. The fact that it's not just photography. We go to Comic Cons, we go to different conventions aside from that, and it's just like a family thing at this point in time. The girls that I've met doing this and the connections that I've made from working with Queen City Pinups is something I couldn't get anywhere else. I feel like a lot of people are undecided because they see models and think that these are perfect girls. And let's be honest, me, normal Rachel, doesn't have makeup on, doesn't have anything going on at all. Glasses, ponytail, kind of like this, but a little bit more of a mess. I think that someone that is undecided about something like this has that mentality, like, hey, I'm not pretty, I can't do this. I will tell you, coming in here, personally from shooting with Bob alone, and seeing the pictures on the camera and being like, wow, that's what I actually look like versus when I take a selfie and it's not flattering. Um, it's awesome. It's awesome being able to see that and seeing your body and your face through someone else's eyes. And it's amazing. So being able to tell somebody, you know, you might not trust what you look like right now, but give it a chance. I totally mean that because I've even been surprised. Like, well, that's me. It's awesome. It's super cool. I think one of my biggest concerns was I have always been super into Star Wars in the cosplay side of it, and that's what they did. However, I had no experience in cosplaying. I knew pretty much nothing about cosplay photography, but after sitting down and meeting with Bob and Susan, and they explained pretty much what they do, not only do they have an amazing studio, but they also have the props, they have the costumes, they have everything that you would need to pull that off. I was sold 100%. Like, I, I now can be Padme Amidala, I can be Princess Leia, I can be whoever I want to because I have their support and they're going to provide me with what I need and those tools and resources, which honestly no other studio in Buffalo was able to do that for me. It's going to be an experience like no other. You are going to be sadly disappointed when you work with any other photographer in Buffalo. Sorry, but I mean that. And you're going to love your pictures. You're going to be completely in love with them and want to book your next session the minute that you get home. And I can pretty much promise you that.